Speaking of the Matrix and the Umbrella Corporation, are we living in the Matrix? Because all of a sudden, Tori Bruno, the CEO of ULA, <laughs> shared this image of a Vulcan rocket with three cores to it, a stretched upper stage. So this is, would be like their Centaur 5 upper stage, stretched really tall, uh, and just casually just shows it by demand of the internet. <laughs> not <laughs> not anything to do with the rocket. Here's the it's uncropped the version of my flip-flops. But then he says, just a, a model related to a routine ongoing trade study, nothing more. So in other words, he's trying to say that, you know, we aren't committing to this, but we're looking into it using yeah. like a Vulcan Heavy, a tri-booster Vulcan Heavy, for those of you listening that can't see this. I totally read that wrong. You know, you know these are my flip-flops, like I'm just a model. <laughs> it's only a model like you know it's just a like, model i'm i'm just camelot. an influencer camelot these were just flip-flops yeah. i'm just an influencer oh this is <laughs> exactly. a exactly. this is a rocket in the background yeah but the cool thing about this would be you know if they so oh, this brought up some good discussions and you know if they did something like that that would be an extremely high performance rocket you know now we're talking about something that would, so, Nice. There's the there's the can't fit it in it. Vulcan. Where did you get this from? From Tori Bruno. Tori, Tori, I, well, I send me from, from from ULA. Is his name not Tony? No, it's Tori. Tori, send me a model. Are you what, Joe? Dusty. How'd you when? Why don't I have any? So uh, look what's behind you. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. That's the point. Like, I, I want some ULA rockets here. I'm not <laughs> representing. A Twitter called Toy Bruno's Teeth. <laughs> yeah, it's a parody account. <laughs> um, but back to the hardware real quick. I just want to wrap this up of like, you know, this would be a lot of people are kind of against the heavy configurations like this because it adds a lot of complexity. You change your center core has to be a lot stronger. You're adding all these extra parts for... Um, for additional performance, of course, but it's like a lot of the industry is just going, let's just build a bigger rocket instead of sticking more. And that, mm -hmm. we'll see what they do if they figure out. Again, he's saying this is a routine ongoing trade study. It's these the compromise of rockets. Like, is it worth it? Is there enough market for these heavy payloads that this vehicle could could perform for? Is there a demand for that? How much is it going to cost us to engineer this? How much would it cost us to launch it? Is there is that affordable and viable? It's fun to see that they're they're even tinkering with it. I mean, why not? That's awesome. Yeah, they then they did that same thing by the way with the Atlas rocket. The Atlas rocket also had models and and versions that were uh, a tricore like heavy Atlas and Atlas heavy, and it never. And here's actually a picture of that. Jamie Grow, uh, she asked about that, which is really keen on a good observation. Absolutely. And Tori goes, yeah, you know, here's. Here's our Atlas Heavy version, even, and he had a model of it. So, mm. other side of his office. Yeah, and as we know, that that never happened. But it's just again proving the point that like they is they, that of what they were called those trade they, studies. Like, so Falcon Heavy was the con the name Heavy was is like a commonly used term. Yeah, that's been around for a long time. Yeah, especially when it comes to like the tri core stuff like that. When it's when you have like three booster cores that are similar diameters, uh, even though like the Titan Heavy had solid rocket boosters, but those solid rocket boosters were the same size as the center core. Like it was huge. So it was considered the Titan heavy, you know, it's, mm. yeah, it's kind of like the tri-core configuration ended up getting the heavy configuration or. Got it. Ocean. So those, yeah. mean, those names space mean program. something. <laughs> it is all just Kerbal Space Program. Just starts stacking stuff together. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, thanks so much for watching this clip from our show. If that's just not enough for you and you want to watch the full episode, you can go to olfpod.com slash YT. And if you want more from us, you can consider becoming a Patreon member. You'll get early access to episodes. You can join our awesome community. You can actually watch us record live and get your name in the credits by going to olfpod.com slash Patreon. So thanks everyone for watching. Check back every Friday for new clips here and new episodes on the main channel. Thanks, everybody.